Hi everyone, happy Saturday. So today I have the day off, so I am just hanging out, walking around. I'm gonna vlog and bring you guys along with me. Bay's here too. Shopping, right? Shopping. Did you decide on what shirts to get? No, I don't think I'm gonna get anything here. Why not? They don't feel perfect. You wanna go to Adidas right now? Yeah, but I wanna get this long sleeve shirt for running when it gets a little colder. Boom. Let me show you guys what I got. I got these running shoes. They're from Adidas and I think they're called Ultra Boost Cageless something. Um, they're basically like a sock with like some cushioning on the bottom and they're really comfortable when I tried it out at the store. So we'll see how they feel tomorrow when I go on my long run. And also, I picked up a long sleeve shirt from Nike. Um, just a regular white long sleeve shirt with some like venting in the back. So I think these will be good for like a cool fall day run. Super excited to run now that I have all these new things I can try out tomorrow. Yay! So today is Sunday. So yesterday, after I came back from shopping and getting the sneakers and the shirt, I rested for a little bit and then I worked on my presentation for Monday in medicine rotation and other rotations uh, residents have something called morning report which is supposed to be like an educational time for everyone residents and students so my team is going to be presenting a patient and I had to prepare a small like PowerPoint presentation about the uh, topic so um, I think we are presenting a patient who ended up having a retroperitoneal mass so I prepared a little like very short PowerPoint presentation so that's what I did yesterday. Today is Sunday and Sunday is usually when I do my long run so I'm gonna be going for a run in a little bit. It was raining this morning but I think it stopped. It's a little humid but I think today will um, I think it's still a uh, decent weather for the run so I'm gonna go to Central Park and do my long run. Hi. All right, I'm gonna get ready. Gonna run in my new shoes, Adidas Ultra Boost. Uh, I'll let you guys know what it's like. I'm still trying out a bunch of different new shoes. Um, so so far I've run in three different types of sneakers, um, some old, some new, um, and I feel like I don't really have a good sense of like what's the right type of sneakers for me. So I'm just trying them out um, and kind of seeing how I feel. So Ultra Boost is gonna be the sneakers that I'm gonna be wearing today so we'll see how it goes. Alright so we're gonna start here 90 seconds or 90th street go around the loop all the way down all the way down to 59 57th street 59th street and then do crossover at 72nd do this loop one more time and then come back up to 90th street here again. Don't just wait for you here why? You're gonna quit? I'm gonna quit. Oh, you're gonna get here faster, you mean? No, I'll just like chill here for a long time. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright. It's a cloudy day today. How was it? Oh, it's still going. That's so hard. Oh my god, do I look crazy? <laughs> I ran 7.8 miles. The longest run of my life. <laughs> are you improving? Um, let's see. There are my splits. I stay pretty consistent. I feel like this is how I was running like two months ago. <laughs> That's good. I mean, you still have two months. All right, so review of the shoes. It was pretty good. I felt pretty comfortable. I didn't have any crazy aches or anything. Um, I did get this nasty blister on the back of my heel and a lot of people had complained about this in the reviews and I guess my socks weren't high enough so I got this blister um, both sides actually um, but other than that I thought it was a pretty good um, comfortable shoes to run in so I would do it again I would just wear higher socks
So I mentioned earlier today that I'm trying out three different pairs of running shoes and I just wanted to show you guys which ones they are. So these were my first running shoes. They're still, I guess, relatively new, um, but they're from Nike. They're the Zoom, Nike Zoom All Out. And it's got this like clear, what do you call this? Like airspace bubble thing for support. The other pair I have is Asics. These are the Kayano 24s, I believe. Gel Kayano 24s. These I actually felt like were a little tight in like the the widest part of my foot i do have kind of a white uh white feet so these i remember hurting um a little bit when i first ran in them and the pair that i got most recently is these um adidas um ultra boost and i showed you guys the blister that i got from here so i need to definitely wear higher socks something that i found out yesterday at nike when i was looking at shoes um, you can run in their shoes, but if you don't like them, you can actually return them even after you run in them. I don't know if it's true for Asics or Adidas, but for Nike, they definitely said you can run in them and you can bring them back if you don't like it, even if you've worn it already. So that's pretty cool. So if you guys are in the market for new running shoes, you can try it out and bring it back if you don't like it. Hey guys, so it's about my watch on it's about nine o'clock on a sunday night tomorrow i'm gonna be moving down to my hospital i told you guys it was a little far so i've been commuting but I, i'm gonna stay there for a week because housing became available so i'm packing right now bit of a mess here got all my work clothes here just like keeping it simple because i'm just gonna be there for a week um i have like black pants and then I have these like three sleeveless shells in like three different colors. They're all from Ann Taylor. Um, it's like silk in the front and it's like um, like cotton in the back so they're super comfortable. So I have it in black, navy, and like this like blush pink color. And then some workout clothes here and then some like lounge clothes, toiletries and sneakers and everything is in here right now. Not quite done packing. It's gonna be really nice not have um, not having to commute so far every morning. So, um, I'm really looking forward to just staying there. I'm gonna be staying with my friend Dania. She's also doing her rotation um, at the same hospital so we're gonna stay together and tomorrow we'll, I'm gonna be getting up at like 5 and leaving by 5 30 as I've been doing for the past two weeks but after that I'm gonna be staying there and I can sleep in till like 6 a.m. so it'll be a lot nicer. So I'm gonna continue packing and I will check in with you guys later. All right, so I'm all packed in this little suitcase. So those of you wondering, uh, Candy is staying with Bay for the time being. Um, I can't exactly bring her to the hospital housing, so she's going to be staying with him for the week. Having a cat, even though cats are pretty low maintenance, can be tough sometimes in medical school. Um, in fourth year especially, you do end up doing a lot of traveling from OA rotations and interviews and things like that. So it's nice to have somebody that you can trust who can look after your cat. Um, so plan for the rest of the night. Um, it's about 940 something. So I'm going to practice my presentation a little more. Um, you do a lot of presentations in medical school. You do a lot of public speaking um, in small groups, big groups. Um, but I still get a little nervous, especially the one for tomorrow because I'm going to be speaking in front of all the residents and attending so or some of the attendings so i'm just going to go over my presentation make sure i know everything that i'm going to say and just practice my presentation a couple times um so that i'm really ready so i'm going to do that and then i'm going to head to bed because i have to wake up early tomorrow to drive to the hospital so hope you guys enjoy the vlog um i will see you guys in the